Hi everybody, welcome back to the Pixar Cars Thomas and Friends fan channel. Today's video is all about the Thomas and Friends train table. How many times have you had your son or daughter to Chapters or Toys R Us and they start playing with the Thomas and Friends table that's made up a certain way and you can't get them away from it. They spend an hour there or half an hour or as long as they stay and you literally have to drag them away to get them out of there. And then you go home and you try and build the exact same set. And it's impossible. But we have the table and all the stuff necessary to build the exact same table you see at Chapters or Toys R Us. So we're gonna take this set apart and show you exactly how to build it so your son or daughter will be able to play at home just like they do at Chapters or at the Toys R Us store. So stay here and we'll take this apart and put it all back together piece by piece. Okay, now we have the table completely empty and all the parts you need are lined up on the floor. What's the name of that train station there in the middle? Is that Tidmouth. Deluxe? Tidmouth. Tidmouth Sheds. Well, we have two Tidmouth Sheds. We have regular and deluxe. That's half and half. It's half regular and half deluxe. Two bridges. This four-way. Could be for cars or trains. We have a water tower. A switch track. Not switch track. It's a... Uh, Change direction. And we have, what's that little schoolhouse? Not a schoolhouse. This is the Navigator Station, the old one. It's a tunnel. A tunnel. And we have this thing, oops. We have this. There we go. We have this thing here. And there it goes. And 13 of those. They call there those trestles, I guess. trestles, supports, supports. Yeah, a bunch of turns. How many turns are there? Eight large turns and 18 quarter turns. And I think I see about five straight pieces, six inch ones, and assorted smaller ones. Now we're going to put this together piece by piece on the table. So we're going to do a stop lapse, a time lapse photography. So the first piece that goes on is timber sheds. Okay, after Timbit's shed, we'll install an after station and the water tower and a couple of the other things. Just like this here. Now we'll put the bridges on and the water tower. Now we'll attach the pieces with some track. Okay, we have a few pieces put on and connected. The bridge, an after station. Now we'll work on some more. Okay, now we got this part of the track hooked up. Good. Then we'll move on to the other side. Okay, we got this part of the track on. And there's a lot of ups and downs here. There's a water tower in place. We snaked around back of timber sheds. Okay, we got that piece on that goes right around to the bottom. There's always a dead spot right here. Doesn't do anything. Now let's go back over to finish this part. Off. And there's a general overlay of the track at Toys R Us or Chapters. Let's put the trains on, son. Okay, the trains are all back on. Now, this was the chapters. Your son or daughter will be playing with it for hours. There we go. Around we go. <laughs> there we go. Okay, more Thomas. And there's James getting some water at the water tower. And Victor, what's Victor doing here? He's not even a popular train. Oops. This is very hard working with the train on the floor. Where is he? Okay, that's all I'm gonna show for now. Thanks. Thanks for watching everybody. I hope you like our interpretation of the train track. And um, if you have any comments, let us know. I got my health back here. Where's his hand? There he's waving. It's on the floor working the trains. Thanks for watching everybody. Have a great day.